Beautiful day out there, but the winds are starting to pick up and those winds are going to get really strong this week, especially on late Tuesday and again on Wednesday afternoon. Some of the wind gusts could be 35 and 40 miles per hour. That's strong enough a wind. If we were to get some kind of a grass fire or something like that, even though temperatures will be mild, the potential for a quick spread is there. Currently, no advisories. We're just under wind advisory criteria currently. I can see our camera shaking around a bit in the wind. Seven day forecast at the bottom of your screen. Do you want 10 days of a forecast? Head over to my weather app and it's right there along with hourlies and a lot more. 67 Santa Maria, 69 San Luis Obispo, 98 Paso Robles, 66 in Lompoc and 65 in Santa Barbara. And the winds right now 15 to 20 miles per hour with gusts higher than that. Here's the wind forecast. You can see it's windy out there. The modeling is showing us all on shore here. We do see a little bit of a shift later on tonight, but still the winds could be quite breezy until right after sunset. At the coast, some of the winds will stay up overnight as we get into early tomorrow, though. Watch this tomorrow afternoon. Starting to see those winds at about 15 to 20 with higher gusts. And again, late tomorrow into Wednesday, that's really when the winds start picking up. The modeling is probably underdoing it here. Again, I like some of the gust potential of the coast to be closer to 30, 35 miles per hour. Potential kind of advisories would be a wind advisory, maybe uh, another air quality alert in that Napomo Mesa area. When we see any kind of activity plus 25 mile per hour winds, then you start to see particulate matter blowing around. So temperatures are running cooler than this time yesterday, and they'll be dramatically cooler inland tomorrow because the pace of the wind will actually bring cooler air inland. Now, when you look at mid to upper 80s, that still seems quite warm. It's actually right around average for Paso Robles. So after a couple of days where temperatures were closer to 100, including today, so basically three days in a row, that's relief. San Luis Obispo, low 70s with those winds really being up much of the afternoon. Same story in Santa Maria. We'll peak at one and two, but when those winds are at about 20, 25 miles per hour, the temperatures will come down in the late afternoon. It's hot elsewhere too. Las Vegas, 106, 107 in Phoenix, but just 67 San Diego and 65 in the Bay, 94 in Sacramento right now. So we have this ridge of high pressure that's moving out. We have this little trough that's digging in. That is increasing the northwesterly flow. We also have a little bit of return flow here from the south, uh, so it's actually going to be cooling the Santa Barbara area as well. Microclimate model doesn't show us much currently in the way of marine layer, but when the winds calm down later on tonight, we're going to see a little bit pushing up into the channel. Uh, I think for much of the central coast, the pace of this wind will keep us with mostly clear skies until we get into Wednesday when we start to see a bit more of a formation of the marine layer in the night and morning hours. All right, let's take a look at this forecast here for tomorrow. Again, we're coming off the peak heat. 86 past the rubble, 71 San Luis and Santa Barbara, 66 in Lompoc at 69 in Santa Maria. Santanez Valley temperatures near 80, closer to 90 out in the Cuyama Valley, maybe just a little shy. 68 Napomo, 65 Pismo Beach, 63 Los Osos. Again, a pretty decent breeze in the afternoon. 85 Atascadero, 88 San Miguel. Extended forecast, the trend fairly steady once we do this drop at places like Santa Maria and Santa Barbara. Paso Robles is always the interesting story. So coming off that heat, we're going to come all the way down to 79. That's below average, then warming back up a little. I don't see any heat waves this upcoming forecast or probably even into two weeks. So probably not going to see a 100 degree plus temperature in a little while. And that's